Good evening, teacher. Good evening, class. How are you? Can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Yes, teacher, I can hear you. Okay, everybody can hear me? Yes, teacher, I can. Okay, wonderful. Welcome, welcome everybody. How are you doing today? How are you today? I'm fine, teacher. Thank you. What about you? Um, I'm fine. I'm good. Good. Just a little bit uh, hot. Only that. I there's. It's very very hot today. Have you felt have you felt that it's also very hot? Not so much. So so Right, yeah. If Tune felt very hot, it, it felt like it was like a February already. Okay, well, everybody, welcome to today's class. Um, let's see, we're still ha we still have uh, lots of people that are going to be joining us. Uh, wow, there's still lots of people. Let's wait for them. Okay, well, while everybody um, is waiting, sorry, is uh, joining us, in the meantime, we're going to be starting the class. Um, well, good to see everybody. Um, I wanted just to make sure that everybody it has been able to go into the platform. Has everybody been able to join the, um, the, the course on, in the platform? Can you guys hear me or are you having problems hearing me? I can hear you teacher. Uh, yesterday I <clears throat> logging in the platform. Okay, good, excellent. Okay, very good. Um, maybe it will work better if I ask individually. Um, so let me ask, um, let me start with Manuel. Manuel Gutierrez, were you able to get into the platform? Yes, uh, I can. I, yes, I can. Okay, excellent. No All right, perfect. Thank you. What about Glenn? Uh, your microphone, Glenda, you need to uh, turn on your microphone. Okay, thank you. Uh, I was here uh, looking for the lesson uh, one. Uh, this I have the objectives so clear, and we are here. Sorry, I, I couldn't see where you're on. What 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 section is that? Uh, this is the first section. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay, great. That's wonderful. Okay, thank you. What about Pablo? Um, Pablo Ernesto, have you been able to get into the platform? I still don't platform. I was busy. Oh, okay. Okay, I understand. Do you think that you will be able to um, get on the platform this, eve uh, this evening? Pa Pablo, do you think you can uh, you will be able to um, get into the platform tonight? Yes, yes. 
Oh. Okay, perfect. Excellent. All right. What about uh, Juan Carlos? Have you been able to get into the platform? Uh, Juan Carlos, I, I think, sorry, um, sorry, uh, Juan Carlos, I need you to open up the microphone. Okay, okay. Um, I visiting, I was visiting uh, Saturday, Sunday, Monday and night, and, and today. Uh, I'm trying to do, I'm I going to section 1.7. Okay. Okay, so it, it is working then, right? The platform is working. Yes, yes it is. Okay, good, that's the important thing. Okay, good. All right, what about Jenny? Jenny Quesada? I work in the platform, um, but I was busy, but I try to uh, continue today tonight after the class okay no that's fine that's fine i just want to know if it if you can get into the platform so um don't worry if you i mean i'm not asking if you if you have done the exercises i just want to know if everybody can see the platform everybody can get in so that's right excellent thank you jenny what about leticia yes teacher uh, I came in yesterday. Uh, you started watching in the video of unit or number one. Perfect. Okay, that's great. Thank you, Leticia. Okay, good. Uh, what about Manuel Gutierrez? Were you able to get in there? Sorry, teacher. Um, I'm asking if you are were able to get into the platform. Uh, uh, yes, I, I, teacher, tengo problemas con el, el internet. No, no, no le entendí un poquito, pero eh, voy a apagar la cámara, perdón. Okay, that's okay. Just, I uh, just want to know, Manuel, can you see the platform? Can you work on the platform? Uh, I don't. Uh, uh, I no, no see you platform. Oh, okay, you have not seen the platform. Manuel, you have not gone into the platform? No, no ha entrado usted la plataforma? Teacher, eh, aún no he entrado todavía en la plataforma. Ya, ya probé, ya entré, pero eh, no le he visto aún. Sí, sí puedo entrar, perdón. Okay, but yeah, that's what I'm interested. I want to know if you can enter. You don't have to have done any exercises. I just want to know if it's possible to enter, that's only that, okay? So that's good, excellent. Francisco, Francisco Rojas, can you get into the platform? Hello, good night. Uh, I haven't worked yet. Sorry. Okay, it's okay, but okay, but you can go into the platform? Yes, I'm getting. Okay, good, all right, excellent. Yes. Ok, eh, bye. chicos, solo, lo único que quiero saber, o sea, cuando les pregunto, solo lo único que quiero saber es, ¿pueden ustedes ingresar a la plataforma? ¿Le funciona el, 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 um, el, el enlace? ¿Les funciona la contraseña y todo? Yes. Eso es lo único que quiero saber, ¿ok? No problem, so, eh, so, Saraí. 
Yes, teacher. Good, good. Uh, Elena Cerrate? Yes, teacher. I can log in the platforms. Perfect. Okay. Uh, Roxana? I think Roxana doesn't have audio. Okay, uh, Vilma, Vilma Lisset. No problem, teacher. Okay, excellent. Avi? Avi Marroquín? Yes, I can, teacher. Perfect. Okay, good. Excellent. Uh, Luis Canales? Yes, teacher. All good. Excellent. Uh, Luis Alberto? Yes, teacher. I was working on the platform last night. Oh, beautiful. Okay, excellent. Um, Rebecca? Hi. I already can log in into the platform. Wonderful, great, thank you, Rebecca. Uh, who's it? Yes, teacher, I haven't any problem with the platform. Okay, perfect. Is there? Esther Dominguez, can you hear me? Esther, Esther Dominguez, can you hear me? Yes, teacher. Okay, perfect. Can you get into the platform? Yes, he's working. Okay, perfect. Uh, Marina? Yes, teacher, I can. Wonderful. Flor? Yes, teacher, I can. Excellent, thank you. Kelly? Yes, teacher, I can. Okay, you can go into it. Wonderful, excellent. Uh, Veronica? Yes, teacher, I can. Okay, wonderful. Uh, Roxana? Roxana de Solís? Roxana de Solís, can you hear me? Hello. Hi. Um, are you able to get into the platform? Hello, can, you, can you see the information from the platform? Yes, I was problem with the platform. You have problems with the platform? I had problem. I had problem with the platform, and I I knew in the platform. Okay, so you you do not understand how to get into the platform. Yes. Okay, okay. Let's do something then, Roxana. Um, uh, maybe maybe um, later after the class, I can help you to get into the, the platform. 
okay and that way um you you will be able to use it okay Okay, great. And last, uh, what about Godofredo? Can can you access the platform? Yes, teacher, I can't. Okay, you can or you can't? I can. Okay, perfect. Excellent. Very good. Okay, so only um, Roxana in this moment is having problems. Okay, good. It, it's important for me. I'm asking everybody because it's important that I know everybody in my class has access to the platform and can use it because sometimes students have problems and then they tell me like two or three weeks later and then then it's really, really late, right? Um, it's really late to be helping you two, three weeks later because you have missed too, too many important, um, uh, well, time, basically. Okay, so it's very important that um, we are able to all connect to the platform. If you have questions uh, about the platform, please ask me. Um, I, I, I may not be able to a answer immediately um, in the WhatsApp group. Um, it's both may, may, mainly, ugh, sorry, mainly because um, I'm very busy during the during the day. Um, I, um, I have another job and um, I'm very 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 busy during the day. Um, but when I finish the job or in the middle of um, of the job, if I can, I will answer as much as possible. Uh, but please try to be very specific if you have questions about the platform. For example, if there there is a question that you have, be very specific and tell me, um, teacher, I don't understand this exercise and tell me um, section 4.3, for example, and um, exercise number six to give an example. So I need you to be very specific because sometimes some students just um, send me a picture and then I'm like wondering what's, where is the exercise? I have to go through the whole platform looking for that exercise. So please try, if possible, to, to tell me um, exactly which exercise you need help with and that way I can help you. Okay, so anyways, I have talked too much. It's your turn to talk, <laughs> okay? Um, last class, uh, which was yesterday, um, I asked everybody to make some sentences. So what I want you to do right now, um, these sentences are about yourself, okay? And what I want you to do, we're gonna be working right now in um, breakout rooms, okay? Uh, I'm going to have you, let me see, there are, 22 students. Okay, so I will break you up into, see, um, maybe groups of three or four, okay? And I want you to share with your classmates your your information. I ask everybody to make, um, you know, uh, between eight to, to 10 sentences about your past, right? And I gave you some examples there. Uh, for example, you could say I was born in Santa Tecla in hospital, blah, blah, blah. You know, I went to this elementary school. Um, I don't know. You could even talk about like, um, you know, uh, not just like very, very far away things, but also things that are recent. Maybe you can say um, I got married last year, right? Or I, um, I had, um, I had a baby um you know, last month, I don't know, whatever, right? So I, I want you to share with your classmates the information and please be careful because I want you not only to share, but to also correct. So if your partner is saying something like, to give an example, um, I, I go it to, I don't know, um, I, I go it to um, San Francisco 
high school, for example. Uh, go with, you know that is incorrect, right? What is the past of go? When, 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 when. when. Exactly. You know that when that go is an irregular verb, so the it's not going to be go it, it's going to be went. So you're going to have to correct your classmate, right? Also, if your partner, if your classmate says something like, um, I didn't go, sorry, I didn't went um, to high school. I didn't went to high school. That would be incorrect as well, right? Because you know that after did or uh, didn't, we never use the verb in the past. We, uh, we put the, the verb in the basic form. So I want you to pay attention to your classmates and be able to correct them, okay? Is that clear for everybody what you're gonna be doing? Yes, teacher. It's clear? Yes, it's clear. Yes, teacher, it's clear. Okay, I'm going to put you right now to work in the in the um, the breakout rooms, and I will come around and help you if you need any help. Okay. Okay, we're ready. Go for it. Hi. Hi. Hi, Abby. Hi, Godofredo. Hold on. My name is Glenda. <laughs> nice to meet you. Uh, nice to meet you, Hi. too. Nice to meet you, too. OK, so go ahead and join your groups. Roxana, are you there? Roxana, can you hear me? Roxana, can you hear me? Um, eight. In 2011, I participate in the World Youth Day. Okay, this is okay. about me. Who's next? <clears throat> me. <laughs> okay. okay. My story is about a, a trip. 
Uh, okay. Um, two years ago, I went to the El Pital. It was amazing for me to stay there. And I was all the afternoon. I enjoyed the view, the mountain, the food. And I ate typical food. And then I walked about 30 minutes. I enjoyed the trip. The weather was so cold. And for me, it was an amazing day to spend there. <laughs> Just that. Good, Fleur. Thank you. Okay. Who next? Roxana or Kelly? And at the University of El Salvador, I graduated from teacher in Basu. Oh, that's great. The <laughs> <laughs> sentences where where were you from, Juan Carlos? Sentences. Where, where were you from? Uh, I work in CAP. Um, this uh, is, in, is in Apopa City. Okay. Rebecca? Or you stay? <laughs> okay. Um, I was born in El Salvador on August 15th. In 2001, I used to live with my brother and my parents a few years ago, but currently I only live with my mom. I finished my high school, my high school in 2019 when I was 18 years old. I, start, I started to study industrial engineering at University of El Salvador last year. Okay. Do you want to ask me something? Uh, I I do a sentence, a, sorry, a question only what to do. For, for example, a... when you were a kid. Okay. Okay. No, I, I didn't have a pet. And what about you, Godofredo? Do you have do you have a pet when you was a child? When you were a What's child? Sorry, pet? Were, when you was or when you, you were, were a child? What's that mean pet? Mascota. Mascota. Eh. I, no, no, no. <laughs> Uh, ad hoc. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. And you, Vilma, do you have a, a pet? I know. I allergia. <laughs> I was married four years ago. <laughs> and you, Sorry. Marina? Is the question, Manuel? Yes. What is the question? Uh, are you married? Yes. Okay. I got married. Five years ago. Uh, I am not. I was married for years ago. <laughs> for years. Comprende <laughs> mano. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> 
I start my uni my university the university in 2015 and I finish my university pension in 2020. And two days ago, two days ago, I went to a job interview and I did exercise today. And you, Abby? Abby? Oh, Esther? Sorry, sorry. I have a problem with the internet. Okay. And Esther? I was born in Salvador. I have, no. I studied basic education at the educational complex teacher, Maria Mandartiga de Villalta. I completed. <laughs> yes. Okay. Okay. Good in... question, um, Glenda. Okay. Uh, Glenda. Jenny, uh, Glenda. Glenda. What was your last vacation? My last vacation. Ooh, I don't remember because <laughs> <laughs> there were Linda, there were pandemia. Linda. Uh huh. Yes. No, my last vacation was here at <laughs> home. The best, huh? the best vacation. The best. The best vacation. vacation. Uh, I don't have a a best vacation. Linda, one thousand nine hundred ninety-nine. Sorry. Vacation. Your vacation. Well, yes, the vacation, um, maybe no vacation, but I went to Israel uh, to a course about uh, science and technology. And I say there around 28 days, mm -hmm. almost a month. Uh, and it, were, it was a good experience. So nice uh, because we, I don't remember, ride, we ride camels. Uh, we navigar, navigar. Tell me how do you say navigar? Navigar, if we were. Oh, sail. Sail? sail? Ah, yes. Uh, sail. Uh, we sail in. Uh, Surf in the internet. Tiberia, Tiberia. Uh, ah. uh, we call the Mar de Galilea. Uh, we went to the Jesus Tomb. Uh, we went to Nazareth, we went to Cesarea, we went to the Desierto. How do you say this Desierto in English? Desert. 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 Okay. I yo confundo el postre con el desierto. <laughs> yeah. Sorry, desert. sorry. But, but they were the, the best vacation of my life because uh, we eat, we ate. Uh, all the food that we want because that's todos los tiempos de comida uh, every meal uh, where buffet uh, we stay in many different hotels and we met uh, many things many stuff about uh, the schools and the college there you 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 saw, not mm -hmm. you met. You saw because you meet you meet people. Okay, thank you. Wow, look at her! Like they say in Spanish, "Quién la ve?" You asked a good question, Jenny. 
That's, that's what it is. And what about you, Leticia and Jenny, about vacations? I'm in only now Guatemala. <laughs> no, man. <laughs> My but Guatemala is a good trip. Guatemala has yeah. many beautiful places. Yeah. Yes, yes. Guatemala. Um... Hello, teacher. Hello, teacher. I'm back. Great. Yeah. Okay. All right, class. Um, We're then, here again. Back again. Okay, excellent. Very good. So um, I was hearing some of your conversations, and uh, it sounds some of the things that I heard were very interesting. Uh, you guys have very interesting stories, and... Um, uh, very, very great conversations. That's great. Okay, just a, a reminder that we're going to look at, I'm going to share the PowerPoint presentation. And I just want you guys to remember a little bit about the, sim the simple path. <laughs> All right, can you see this? Yes. Yes, teacher. Yes, yes teacher. Yes, teacher. Yes. Yes. Okay. So I'm just I'm just gonna make a little bit yes. bigger because I know that some people um, are not able to see it so well because they're on a smaller device. So I'm just gonna make this bigger. Um, okay. So. Uh, so uh, this is um, English Intermediate One. Your facilitator, you know that it's, uh, is uh, Jessica Guerrero. And today is day number two. It's Tuesday, January 26, 2021. Okay, so um, just a reminder of the irregular verbs. Okay, some irregular verbs. I sent you a list um, yesterday in the WhatsApp group. If there is somebody that didn't get the list, um, let me know so that I can send it to you. Um, so this is just a you know short list of the regular verbs. Uh, please make sure that you that you um, that you are able to um, memorize them. Uh, you need this. You really, really do need it. Okay. So if you don't understand, um, if you're if you're having trouble uh, remembering something, a technique that I can. Um, I can give you is try to make um, small pieces of you know like uh, flashcards and write on one side the, the 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 basic form and on the other side put the simple past and and test yourself and say okay all right to give me an example go go what's the past of go try to remember and then and then turn it around and say oh yeah I got it right or I got it wrong so that's something I can help you, I, I, like a little tip that I can give you um, to help you. Now, um, now let's talk a little bit about um, the structure. The structure that we have, we have here the affirmative, okay? 
In the affirmative, like we said, most of the verbs that are regular, we just simply go subject plus verb plus ed, or like we spoke yesterday, it can have either be just a D if the verb is um, finishes in E, or it can be I, E, D, if the verb finishes in a consonant plus a Y. And then we have the complement. Example, they played soccer. So we have they is a subject, play is the verb, and play is a regular verb, so we put E, D, and then the complement is soccer. Or in the negative, we put subject plus didn't, plus a verb, plus a complement. For example, you didn't eat chicken. So we have that you is a subject, um, it didn't is the negative, the verb is eat, In the notice eat is in the basic form, it's not in the past, and then complement is chicken. Or the interrogative. Remember, I, always, I told you that independent of the subject, we're always gonna be using did. So did plus a subject plus a complement. A example, did we play yesterday, okay? So we're always gonna start with did, okay? All right, now, um, just a reminder here that with the verb to be, it's different, okay? So don't forget that we always need to make an exception with the verb to be, okay? Example, a, with the verb to be, instead of saying, subject plus verb plus ed, we say subject plus was or were. So for example, they were friends. Okay, so they is a subject, and then here we're using were because they is plural. So they were friends. And obviously the complement, the complement is friends. Okay, it would not be this one right here. It would be this one. And in the negative, it's not, we're not gonna be using did not or didn't. You're not gonna be using that with would be instead we're going to be using was not or were not plus a complement example they weren't friends you do not say they did not be friends okay so be very careful with that because um it, remember b is is it's a it's an exception to all the rules okay and then in the questions, we're not going to start, we're never going to use did with the verb to be. Instead, we're going to be starting with was or were. Then the subject plus the verb and the complement. So example, no, sorry, not the verb. Sorry, the verb is was or were. Example, um, they weren't friends. Um, it would be in, in, the neg in the question, it would be weren't they friends? So we're just going to change this around, okay? And then here, uh, we have uh, did plus the subject, plus the verb, and the, uh, the verb is going to be in the base form, like work. So it's going to be a little bit different. Now, something I want to um, focus on is when we have question, uh, questions with information, basically information questions. So these are questions where you don't have, you're not going to be answering yes or no. For example, in these kind of questions, like, uh, did we play yesterday? Your answer is going to be yes or no. Yes, I, yes, we did. No, we didn't. But in the case of questions that start with what, where, when, why, and who, you're not going to be, um, you are not going to be, uh, what's it called, using, um, we're, we're not going to be answering yes or no. You're going to be answering with com like bigger complete sentences, right? Or, or better, or at least bigger phrases. Okay. So what would be for questions? Remember where for um, places, when for time, why for a reason, and who for a person. Okay. So we're all going to start with what, where, when, why, who, and these are not the only ones. Do you guys remember what other question words exist that we can start with? Yes, very good. How? What else? We can also use which. Okay, that's another one. Which. 
uh, which is similar to what, but the difference between what and which is that which is when we have an option. We have specific um, amount of options. So when maybe we have two or three or four or five options, whereas what is more general. For example, if, if, um, if let's say you're going to be choosing an outfit, you can say, what are you going to wear? Because there are many, many choices. But then you can say, which shoes are you going to wear? The black ones or the brown ones? So then there's an option. So that way, in that case, you're going to be using which? Because there is a, there is a, um, some sort of option selections that you can, you can choose from. Now, we, after the, the question word, we're always going to be using did. So this is not going to change. And again, remember, it doesn't matter the subject. It's always going to be using did. So here we have the question word, then did. Then comes the subject. So it could be you, they, she, he, I, um, we, or a specific name like Jane, Mark, uh, my parents, uh, my sister, my friends, etc., etc. Okay. Here, then we have the verb, and the verb is going to be in the base form. Or the, so, if you notice, we have read, go, watch, come, help. We're not going to say even if it's she, we would not say she watches. We would just say she watch. Even if it's he, we're not going to say he comes. We're going to say he come. Okay. And then the, the rest of the sentence, or which, which is the complement, right? So we have um, by bus, TV, home, there. So we can que ask questions like this. What did you read? That's it, right? What did you read? Or where did they go by bus? Or when did she watch TV? Or why did he come home? Or who did Jane help there? Is that pretty clear for everybody? Yeah, that was pretty nice. Yes, teacher. It is clear. Yes, yes. yes teacher. I understand. Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Okay, perfect. I'm glad to hear that. Okay, now um, I asked you for homework to uh make some questions and what i'm going to do right now i'm going to get you to work again in groups but i'm going to make the groups a little bit bigger so you have a chance to ask different questions and i would like you to include those five questions and i would also like you to mix other questions with uh question words so instead of just having someone answer yes i did no i didn't um i would like you to ask more questions like uh uh where did you go to high school or who was your best friend in college etc cetera, etc cetera. okay so um, i'm gonna get you to work i'm gonna get you to work in bigger groups okay so let me put you right now in breakout rooms um oops sorry 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 no my mistake um let me see Give me one second. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna make groups of five or six. Okay. Um, okay. All right. We are going to begin. Just give me a moment. Go for it. You can join your groups now.
Manina, do you have any questions? What did you do? What did you went? What did you went? Ah, what did you went? Okay, remember if you're asking a question, the verb is going to be in the base form. You're not going to say, you can't say, where did you went? Because went is in the past. Uh, where did you? And if you used the did. Right, exactly. Did is already. Ah. I'm going to say, where did you, where did you, what, what goes after? Giving it a swiss? Where did you? Do? Where did you do? Uh, well, in this case, you, you said went, right? So what's the, what's the basic form of went? Okay. What's the basic form of went? Anybody? Go. Go. Exactly. Okay. So you say, where did you go? Not where did you went? Okay. Okay. Good. Continue. Continue. Go ahead. Thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Um, first, uh, what did you do play soccer? What did you? What did you do? What did you play? Okay, good. What is the question for? Um, Francisco Rojas, what did you play? Ah, me, <laughs> sorry. Uh... You can, I exactly. think it's a very difficult this question. Um, uh, uh, easy, okay, uh, uh, easy one to ask. Uh, what did you did? What did you eat in the breakfast today? Let me remember. Uh, oh. Um, I'm ate pancakes. Pancakes. Another question, uh, Luis yeah. Alberto. Esther. I have a question. Where were you born? Uh, Luis Alberto, how long have you being studying English. Oh. Saturday and Sunday, I I need to something in the house is is not rest. You are always both. You do the shortest. Uh, on the weekend, Jenny. No, that the weekend the weekend is short.
Oh, okay, everybody, great. All right, so um, we had the opportunity there to um, uh, to um, ask some questions, and um, we we had um, the opportunity of um, answering questions as well. But I think we need more practice, so we're going to continue practicing in, for next class. This time, I would like you to make ten questions using information questions. Okay, is that clear? So you're going to be asking questions with what, where, when, who, which, or how. Teacher, all in simple past. Yes, uh, yes, obviously all in, in simple past. Very good. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Any questions that you guys have? Remember, 10 sentences so you can ask your classmates tomorrow. Okay. Any, uh, any questions that you want to ask before we leave? Teacher, the question is with uh, personal information. Yes, that's, uh, yes, that's correct. Personal information, yes. Okay, thank you, teacher. Okay, great, guys. I will see you tomorrow then, okay? Take care. Bye. Bye. Take care. Good night. Bye. Good night, teacher. Bye. Goodbye, everybody. Bye. Bye. Goodbye, teacher.